morning guys so i'm starting off going to pilates um not pilates what am i talking about I'm going to a bar class um <coughs> so i had like a yoga pilates studio so that's why i said pilates but um yeah so this makes sense i can't really show you guys fully but just this set i got from abercrombie and fitch on sale last year super cute um but yeah i'm starting off the vlog trying to check this time 9 45 i got time okay so i'm gonna pull i might eat something just because i'm a little hungry but i'm not like gonna i don't know why that got cut off but yeah so i'm gonna eat a little something before i go but i like to start my mornings off by reading these little affirmation cards so let me grab them back my friend got me these as a gift which is so sweet love you yaya um and i've been really into them lately so i've been pulling one every morning I'm gonna pull it out. this one jumped out so i'm gonna just go with that one because it's clearly clearly that's what i need to see so this is unique power it says my uniqueness separates me from the monotony of others and i find great joy in this blending in no longer is in my vocabulary period um i will shine like the moon and stars over everyone i meet i will never again let others diminish my light period and that definitely resonates so i understand why this jumped out but i'm gonna show you guys the card i love these cards like i used to be really into tarot like i didn't do tarot but i would like watch tarot readings but this i just feel connects with me a bit more um and i'm really into affirmation so love this um but yeah i'm gonna go eat breakfast like i said something small i'm probably gonna have like some granola and milk or something like that even if i have i don't know or maybe i think i have a yogurt just finished pear bar for the first time and that was very interesting um i did the classic class and it's very much i think it's similar to like pilates in terms of like the movements that your body is making um and i wasn't used to those movements like it's a lot of like tucking and like using tiny movements um which i feel like when i go to the gym i'm using the complete opposite so it was just interesting to like deal with that but um I feel good though. I feel really good. It's 11:30 now. I'm gonna go home. Probably. I low key wanted. I um. My mom's using my Spotify, but it's okay. She gonna be kicked off in a minute. <laughs> I could tell. So like, I have a Google Home at home, and we have one in our living room. And my mom like, I could see what's playing, and that's not what I was playing when I left. So like, I know she's listening to it on Spotify, but. She's gonna be out of luck when I just kick when I kick her off in a second. Um, or maybe I'll be nice and maybe I'll listen to like SoundCloud or something <laughs> on my way home. So possibly I might be nice today and do that. But I want to get a um acai bowl. I'm literally right by Robex to get an acai bowl. But it's kind of cold. It's not cold. It's 65 degrees right now. It's not super cold, but like I would want on like a hot day. And like I feel like I have oatmeal at home that I got from Trader Joe's that I kind of want to try. Um it's like frozen i think it comes with some kind of topping so i might go home and have that because that i feel like might be a bit better this month the reason i'm like randomly vlogging because i feel like y'all are probably gonna be like girl you do not vlog but i'm vlogging randomly because i'm really like consistency has been my just thing this month my goal i guess is september 25th i think today 24th or 25th and i've just been really focused on being consistent um so i want to be consistent in working out i've been doing the 75 sauce challenge which is you work out for 45 minutes a day every single day um and you read 10 pages of any book you eat well you drink at least a certain amount of water the water i do gotta catch up on because i don't think i drink enough water i drink enough but like i think you're supposed to drink like three liters of water i don't know if i drink that much water i don't know i haven't really been tracking my water but yeah i'm gonna um but so yeah so i've been doing that challenge for the past like maybe two weeks now if not two weeks almost two weeks i like have been really 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 just into um consistency and being consistent i think that is the greatest thing that we can give ourselves and i think that just like 
like if you want people to be consistent with you if you want people to be committed to you you have to be committed to yourself and your goals um so that's just really what i've been in the mood for and also i work from home so like the movement part of it is very important to me because i have gained weight but i haven't like i think i gained weight one i've been working out so some of it is muscles like i was going to a trainer earlier this year i feel like i'm ranting this is three minutes of me ranting so i'm gonna try to wrap this up to be five minutes <laughs> um but i was going to a trainer earlier this year and he was focused on a lot of um muscle stuff like a lot of weight training a lot of heavy weights all that stuff i feel like my body and i gained weight i got a butt which i'm grateful for i love my booty but i feel like what he was training me for like i don't know i feel like my body type and my body like i feel like i know my body best i just felt kind of bulky at a certain point where it's just like i feel like i need these lesser movements i don't need to always keep trying to do a higher weight if that makes sense in terms of like hip thrust for example i remember he would increase the weight and like you know i could do it but i feel like i was putting so much stress on my body so like right now when i work out i'm trying not to put too much stress on my body because i feel like that's where i start to just bulk instead of like i don't know if i'm making sense <laughs> um i hope i am but i feel like i just start to like get buff and brolic instead of like getting slim if that makes sense or just like slightly toning so that's where i'm trying to focus now but like i said i work from home so i'm trying to just increase my movement um by working out every day and i don't go to the gym every day i do try to just to get out of the house um and also so to, to do cardio but i also bought a stepper machine so like i i just got that last week so i've been doing that and i really like it you really do break a sweat and like it's something to do like if i'm watching tv or something like that like i really like it honestly so i might i'm we're gonna see i just got it last week so we're gonna see how like much i use it consistently um but yeah i'm back to the, the consist that's the gym part back to just consistency overall um i saw a tiktok that was just saying I, if i find the creator i definitely saved the video but i don't remember her name off the top of my head but she was saying consistent average action is better than inconsistent perfect action something like that something of the sort and that really really stuck with me like i literally i found this video like last week or two weeks or something that just like blew my mind i'm like that makes so much sense so i with vlogging i'm saying you know i really enjoy making content so i'm just like why am i limiting myself by not making content because i'm waiting for the right time waiting for the aesthetics to be right waiting for xyz right so no we're not doing that anymore so i'm just like this imperfect vlog whatever you know it's not the perfect vlog i'm going to post it because it's going to bring me closer to my goal versus me not recording anything right so yeah that's where i'm at right now so i'm going home take a shower i really want like <laughs> i'm trying to eat healthy so i'm not gonna do it and i'm going to the biggie on friday so i'm not about to do it but i really want like a bake there's a bakery across the street there's like a few like there's like a donut so i want a pumpkin donut but i'm gonna stay strong i'm gonna stay strong and i'm gonna go eat my own meal at home or maybe i'll make a smoothie i don't know but anyways i'll talk to you when i'm home So hey guys, so now I'm updating you. Um, so I, after I came home from Pilates, not Pilates, I keep saying Pilates, it's not Pilates, from Pure Bar. I think it's a P2, it's Pure Bar, I went to Pure Bar. After I came home, I um, was just chilling, honestly. I took a shower, everything like that. Then my mom cooked, what did I do? My mom cooked, and then, but before she cooked, we went for a walk um, with her and Miko, which is my puppy. Um, I don't know if he's still considered a puppy. He's like a year and a half. Okay. <laughs> he's little, so I found a puppy. We went for a walk, but now my legs are just tired. My legs are so tired, so I'm gonna like lay down. It's like 6 o'clock, about to be 7 maybe. So I'm about to lay down for a little Well, I'll just chill. I don't know if I'm gonna sleep. It's like it's too late to sleep, but I'm just gonna like chill. Probably watch my YouTube. Um, but yeah, tonight I'm probably gonna do. I'm gonna chill for like maybe an hour, then I'm gonna like probably do a face mask, um, and then do some eye patches. 
I'm gonna do my eyebrows today. I want to dye them, but I didn't buy the dye. I'm gonna ask my dad if he has some. Cause what I use is just men's beard and stuff dye, and my dad always has on deck. So <laughs> instead of buying it, I'm just asking if he has like any extra or any bottles. Cause obviously I don't need a whole lot. Um, so I'll ask him that and see if he'll bring it for me. Um, but yeah, I just want to have like a self care, chill night. Um, I'm off tomorrow because my company gives us days of rest, which is really, really nice. So it's like every Monday, every month we get a Monday off. Um, it's like a random Monday though, but like, it's nice to have. Um, who doesn't like days off? I know my clients want to be pissed though because, <laughs> let me tell you about this Friday. This week, work-wise, was like pretty chill, but Friday, it was like good because it kept me busy, but it was OD. Like, it literally was like, alright, y'all need to chill, like, it was requests coming in every freaking hour and I'm like all right like y'all was quiet all week and now on a Friday you're lucky I was in the mood to work but on a Friday like y'all want to be sending me all these things and urgent du, 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 du. like is it really urgent is anything really urgent like that's the thing too. <laughs> let's talk about it because if you work in my field I work in marketing and advertising I feel like these clients be OD be acting like if their ads don't run this is the end of of the freaking world it's not you'll be okay like nothing <laughs> but i don't know if you if you work in my field you definitely understand like the sense the false sense of urgency be there um but yeah i'm gonna talk more about work throughout this vlog but yeah my hair too i might do my hair but i also might not do it because this hair is curly and as you can see i had braids in it earlier yeah i just want to update you guys for a little bit so yeah Good morning, y'all. So today is Monday. Um, it's September 26th. Um, I'm off today. I think I said that in the clip yesterday, but I'm off today because my company gives us a day, a Monday off every month. Um, so I just I woke up. I woke up at the same time. I, well, I mean, I was up since like eight. Actually, this weekend I rested. Like this weekend. I ain't do nothing, which I love. Like, I usually am on the road and stuff on the weekends. But this weekend, I just went, like, yesterday. Y'all saw I went to, like, Pier Bar. But I just went for a walk. Saturday, I didn't really do much. But I love it. Because everybody deserves a break. Um, but I did my normal skincare. So, yeah, like I said, I'm home. So, yeah, I did the normal skincare. Where I use CeraVe Lotion. Black Girl Sunscreen. I wash my face with. I use the CeraVe foaming cleanser but i don't use that every morning um so i'm gonna use this like random cleanser that i have it's very gentle i think it's polished short. i think it's my sister and it's probably old because i think it's from when she lived here which is hasn't been two years at this point so <laughs> but it's very gentle so that's why i use that in the morning because sometimes i don't like to use harsh stuff in the morning but anywho i'm gonna put this on today it's the pixie detoxify eye things because i think i have some bags under my eye focus on me right yeah i mm, i have some bags so i'm gonna use this i got this from target um so yeah i actually just have to throw away because i had some from like two years ago and i feel like i don't know i'm like I'm like being weird with like especially skincare like especially eye stuff like i just know i have like certain eye patches i got from two years ago um, I definitely got them in 2020, so I was like, I threw them away, and I wasn't using them as frequently, but these ones I'm gonna use, cause, this shit was expensive, this shit was like, this is what the packaging looks like, but it was like 20 something dollars, like, I don't remember paying that for what I got, but whatever, um, so yeah, so it looks like, I'm gonna just put these in my eye, I'm gonna drink some tea this morning, um, oh, I have to drink some water real quick because I have to take my breath control. Um, oh, they definitely gave me the scoop thing for a reason, and I'm not using it, but you just scoop it out. I know it's like before I used to put them on, <laughs> so yeah, I got them on. <laughs> this one's sliding down though. Um, but yeah, today I don't know what I'm up to do today. Um, 
drink some water in the morning. Um, I'm probably just gonna chill. I'm about to have some tea. It's like nine o'clock. Um, I might go to Plato's closet because I have some stuff to bring back. And then if I might go to Plato's closet. I might go to the gym, but I'm kind of sore from yesterday, so I don't know if I want to go to the gym. I probably just want to do an out at home workout. Um, because I can go to Plato's closet anytime. Oh, is that the way I'm supposed to put them on? I know some people put them on like this, but look at this box. It has it on like this. Wait, in the little freaking fridge. Oh no, my leg went away. Um, that's what I should have did. It's okay, I'm not wasting these. These are staying on my eye. Um, but next time, I'm gonna probably put them in the fridge before I put them on, cause that would be fire. Okay, I'm gonna just leave it like this, cause clearly this is a dub, but I'm gonna go drink my tea. Oh my, I'm gonna go drink my tea. Miko is right here. Miki, let me grab it. Meeksters, say hello to mommy's vlog. Yeah, you look so big, Papa. He's gotten so big. Like since I got him, he's gotten so big and so crazy to me. Um, he looks like a grumpy old man because he likes to sleep, and Miko will sleep till like 11, 12 every single day. Looking half asleep, so I'm about to play him back. <laughs> okay, hey, y'all. Good morning. So it is Tuesday. Um, what day is it? October 27th. Um, I'm working today and I literally have been like at my computer working since like 8.50. And it, I mean, it's only been an hour, it's 9.55. But like, I was off yesterday and I literally have just been like, replying to emails, replying to emails, replying to emails. Because people, one, a lot of my clients, some of my clients are West Coast. Okay, so some of my clients are West Coast. So like, when I don't respond, they like begin to ask you it's like you need to relax you need to relax um so yeah so i've just been working all morning um all morning i'm talking it's been an hour um <laughs> but yeah i literally have just been like replying to emails like for the past hour like just cranking it out cranking it out um it's not usually like this that's why i'm like oh child work labor like not saying I don't work, but it usually is like it's just because I was off. Um, and then, like I was saying, a lot of my clients are West Coast, so like, well, not a lot, I would say like it's split 50 50. But some of the ones who were like hitting me up that late last week are West Coast, so like they were applying to me at like eight o'clock, nine o'clock our time and expecting me to respond. And it's like, no, baby, I work on the East Coast, so I'm not responding. Um, I'm responding within my designated hours. Um, so yeah, but a little bit about my job. I don't want to go too into detail about my job, but I work at a social media company. I'm an account manager, essentially. My title is a little bit more fancier than that, but I'm an account manager, basically. Um, so I work with different clients and running their ads on the account and stuff like that. Ads on the platform, I mean to say. Um... It's 9.55 right now. I think I have like about maybe 20 more minutes and then I'll clean my inbox at least. Um, clean up my inbox. Maybe half an hour. I don't know. After that, I'll probably do like 15 minutes on my stepper um, for facet cardio. I heard facet cardio is supposed to help you burn fat faster. Um, I don't know why I talked about this actually. So I'm doing the 75 soft challenge. So I'm doing 75 soft that's what I'm talking about. So I'm gonna do 15 minutes on the stepper probably after I finish clearing my inbox. Um and then I'll eat some breakfast. I really am just into since I work remotely and now I fully work remotely. Like before I was associated to the New York office, but like I don't be going into the office, so I was like, let me stop paying this New York City tax because for what? Um <laughs> so I just did that and I think next month it hits in a well next month i'm talking about like next week basically because i think it's the end of this pay period um my next period pay period will reflect that so that's a good thing um so yeah oh shoot i was supposed to talk to someone crap i totally forgot now nah, it wasn't really important like it's important but it was someone that i used to work with and she was interested in a role and i was supposed to call her um i'm actually free 
I'm gonna ask her if she's free around like 11 or 12. Um, I used to call her my work mom because she was so sweet and she like really got me involved. So at my previous job, I was really into inclusion and diversity and she really put, like she literally stalked me in the office. <laughs> but I'm grateful she did because I learned so much doing that stuff. Like, um, sorry, this client, let me, let me reply to these clients and then I will um, get back. So, it's a separate. <laughs> I'm really hot right now. Um, I think I'm going to go do... Not too, but I'm going to make a smoothie probably. Because I have some mango that I think is supposed to go bad. So I'm going to just use that. <laughs> I did 15 minutes on the step because again, fasted cardio. I'm doing... Oh, I didn't mention this in my previous. I'm doing Capri Curves onto her at here. She has a workout plan and I've been doing that. Um, I got it back in like June or July. But I'm just with incorporating into the 75 soft. So she usually has fasted cardio one day. So that's what I just did. My fasted cardio of the day. Um, but I really do like doing it in the morning just to get my body moving. Like I said, I work from home. So I'm really just focused on getting my body moving. Because I've just seen. Um, I just realized I wasn't moving my body. <laughs> it's really the first half of the year. It's really the winter time. So I'm just trying to start doing these things now. So when winter comes around, I'm already in that habit of getting up, doing the step break for 15-20 minutes. Um, or whatever. At least going to the gym. So yeah. Whew, I'm hot. Um, so yeah. So I'm just going to go make a smoothie. Um, and then get back to work. Because what time is it now? I think it's like 9.30. I mean not 9.30. 10.30. So yeah, I'm gonna make a smoothie real quick. So yeah, so yeah, so this is my little concoction. So in the mornings I drink, well not every morning, but I'm trying to start drinking the Super Greens powder. You could put it in your smoothie. It says for smoothies, but when I tell you it takes over the smoothie. So it's literally like, I just been taking it like a shot because I'm like, it makes the smoothie just nasty. So I'm like, I might as well just drink it in water and it'd be nasty. So watch me suffer for like 30 seconds. down Ugh, not good so I drink my smoothie that's my chaser mm-hmm but yeah <laughs> if I would have put it in the smoothie I'm telling you it would have been disgusting like it literally takes over everything in the smoothie it makes it nasty I did it the other day and I was like what is this so I think that like shot method is gonna be my new method of taking it I did it two times before so yeah I think it's gonna be my new method every morning I also want to get the bloom powder the bloom super greens um I don't know if y'all heard of that before um but I want to try those so I think I'm gonna get them I think I'm gonna look into I want to finish this bag though I'm really into right now like utilizing what I have before I buy more stuff because I would definitely keep buying up the world so I want to finish this um this bag I have first which it has like I think 30 days worth of use I've probably used it around 10 times so I probably have like a couple more weeks of use out of it um so yeah so I'm gonna wait to order the bloom then because those have flavors so I'm thinking that those would be better but this one was on sale excuse me at Whole Foods so that's why I bought that one because Whole Foods a couple weeks ago had like a supplement sale or whatever on social media this morning and I'm really proud of myself for that I'm really just I'm a brand new person <laughs> um but yeah so I'm probably gonna go on my phone for a little bit and then um continue working hey y'all I just got off a client call and oh child it's like four o'clock right now I'm tired I am tired today was kind of busy a little busy but yeah I'm about to have the call like I said with my work mom I'm about to text her and see if she wants to talk now um because she was looking at a position at my company that she liked a lot of people are leaving my old company and it's like dang it's like the people are so great but like mm, company not always there so yeah 
So I'm going to text her now, but I'm tired. I want to eat. I'm hungry, but um, I'm going to eat a snack first before. But yeah, just wanted to give you guys a little update. I'm going to do my eyebrows tonight. I'm going to clean them up tonight and dye them because they're looking a little crazy. Y'all, I feel like I keep coming on here and looking crazy. But here's to my workout. It's 7 25 y'all want to know how many times i said f this during this workout like i literally was so over it but i did my three rounds i'm doing the capri curves <laughs> i can't even breathe <laughs> um keep the curves drop the fat plan 2.0 um very good plan very much worth the money very good plan so i've been doing that but the at home sometimes i do the gym but i think i talked about this in another clip but yeah today i decided to do at home <sighs> yeah my body is on fire like today was a full body day but <sighs> so i'm gonna go shower and then I'll probably eat a yasso bar those are my new things because they're only like 100 calories and they taste really good i might eat a yasso bar before i go shower <laughs> Just to treat myself, then go shower. Um, I know I said I was gonna do something with my hair this week. Not doing that tonight. I don't feel like doing that tonight. Um, in my brows. My brows, I'm gonna debate if I wanna do it tonight. I wanted to make a video cleaning them up and scenting them. But I feel like cleaning them up tonight, but I don't feel like scenting them. So I mean I guess I could film the cleaning up part today. And then like but I don't want it to be all in unison, you know. But I'm gonna save it at the end. <laughs> And filming me. Hey y'all, so I just wanted to show you guys like how I clean up my brows and I just tried I think I used to do this though when I used to clean up my brows more frequently. Um but what I did, I look a little crazy right now, I'm not gonna lie. But what I did was I just used a eyebrow pen that I had and just filled in my brows like the shape that I want. Excuse this one because <laughs> excuse that, but this one looks pretty good. So I, and then I just cleaned up around the hairs around. This is basically the same method I'm going to do, like, when I set my brows, it's exactly how they're going to look tomorrow. But tonight, I'm too lazy. I'm going to just do a face mask and go to my bed. Um, but yeah, I think I did a pretty good job cleaning them up. Like, I think they look pretty good cleaned up. I'm going to take this off, obviously. I'm going to go wash my face, take a shower, put my Peach and Lily mask on. That is the best mask ever. I have a sample of it, right? And I'm fighting with myself to buy it full price. But I'm gonna have to do it. Like, I'm gonna have to do it because it's really good. Not a sample. I got like a a gift set and it's a smaller size. Um, but I'm gonna just have to buy the real thing, the full thing. And I don't think they're sold at Sephora because my friend Ariana works at Sephora, so she has like friends and family coming up. But maybe I should look into that if there's like a dupe for it at Sephora because at least I get 20% off at Sephora. Um, and see if that would be cheaper. But yeah. Anyways, rambling, but yeah, I just want to show you guys my brows. So I'm gonna go take a shower and go to my Hey y'all, I look hella greasy because I put squalene on my face when I was gua shying. I should have shown you guys my face before. Um because that mask, I'm telling you that mask just brightened up my skin. I don't know if you guys can tell the difference, but I can brighten up my skin. I do have a few dark marks, but overall my skin has been doing pretty well lately. Um do you want to get rid of this mark though? I have products that I can use though that will get rid of it. Like I have the Faded by Topicals. Um, I have one by, what's that brand? Kiehl's. I have like a small one that I got from Sephora. I have a lot of stuff. So this shall be going soon because I usually break out over here because of my period. Like this is where all my period pimples come. Um, so I have a lot of faded scars here. Literally like, yeah, it just comes right there. So this is my skin like i said i'm still very tired it's like nine o'clock i'm ready for bed i'm about to just hop in my bed watching youtube watch some gossip girl probably and take my booty to sleep good morning y'all so today is thursday september 29th yeah because tomorrow the 30th september 29th um I didn't vlog yesterday because work was a little crazy. We had a couple fire drills we had to fires we had to put out. So I was literally busy the whole day and then I just went to the gym after work. Um and then what did I do after that? Went to the gym, came home, ate, 
yeah but it's i'm happy it's friday junior day the plan is just to work um i'm gonna work out i don't know if i'm gonna go work out at the gym or at home um i gotta see what the day is because like i said i'm following capri curves um think let me actually show you guys the guide hold on one um so yeah so this is capri's guide Oop. so yes yeah, so this is what i'm following let me just scroll through to show you guys the workouts so yeah cardio um this is the gym to be honest i don't feel like doing faster cardio today i'm not even gonna hold you so i might do faster cardio tomorrow morning um we'll see but yeah let me see what the home i think i'm gonna work out at home today because i have to take off my nails too because i'm getting my nails done in the morning i'm getting bold builder gel for the first time i've done well not for the first time first time done by someone else i've done it myself um and i think i'm that's basically what i'm gonna do is just like have her do because this is gel x that i repainted for my birthday so my birthday nails that were in like my mexico vlog i just took off the polish and just repainted them with the gel i had at home just to make it last a little longer um but basically yeah i'm gonna get builder gel good morning y'all so happy friday it's finally friday <laughs> i'm so excited um but yeah so it is 8 40 i'm about to go get my nails done these crusty dusties yeah i had to take off the gel that i had and that process very annoying um <laughs> but it took literally it took me like three hours to take it off um granted i was like taking breaks and granted i was doing both hands and stuff like that but like yeah there needs to be an easier process so that's why i'm getting builder gel so i'm excited to see what builder gel is like um i think i'll like it because my real nails they look crazy right now but my nails grow really long like this is not even the longest they get my nails so i want to try builder gel um to see how strong they can get and I haven't really been getting my nails on on a regular basis in like two years. So I want to try again. And I found it. Like I said, I found this girl. She does like the structured manicure with the builder gel. So we'll see how I like her. Um, and she wasn't too crazy with the prices. Because that's, that's the thing that began me. These people and their damn prices. Um, but yeah. But anyways, um, it's Friday. Like I said, work. I'm going to work when I come home um oh i'm going to the biggie like <laughs> i said that earlier in the vlog but yeah i'm gonna work then go to the biggie um, my nails done cute cute i really like them um she was really nice and really sweet um so yeah i got builder well a structured manicure so basically she just put extend gel she could have extended it a little bit but i didn't ask for any length um so i think i'm gonna keep going to her because i really like when my natural nails are like this like my natural nails like i said grow really long so i want to keep doing that versus like putting i used to get acrylic overlay so i don't want to do that anymore so i got these and i got this nail shape for the first time um i usually do square i think this is gonna have to go on me i don't really like it right now <laughs> but i don't like the nail shape i like my nails but i don't like the nail shape um but yeah i think it looks really cute hey y'all so i finished work um it's like four something right now getting ready to go to the big e um this is my outfit i'm literally just wearing the sweatshirt from where i eat shout out to them if you know who they are um i love them been watching them for years but their stuff is actually pretty fire and this is literally the best sweatshirt that i've ever used in my life like i'm not even being dramatic it's so just like the fit hold on let me flip you all over let me see the fit of it is just like amazing like i don't know i just really like this fit and it comes in like three sizes based on the fit but it's like perfect for like winter and then i just have on leggings around you guys will see what it's like there so i'm glad i'm actually doing something so i have something to vlog um oh lit today my friend yaya she hit me up randomly like well one we were supposed to have plans for next friday but she 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 went up on it because she was flaking on me not flaking on me she has to work um but she got us tickets well free tickets she sent me a link she sent me a link 
or cold rather to free tickets for CultureCon New York so I'm gonna be there I'm gonna vlog yeah so yeah so um that unfocused thing is bothering me but yeah so I'm we're going to CultureCon um, New York and I'm very excited I was thinking about going and I was like <laughs> baby I'm not paying it was like 250 I'm not paying 250 so she's but luckily um the account was girl wonder or girls wonder something like that i followed them and i have to really look at their page because they look super dope but basically they had a um like giveaway or something like that so yeah i thought that was super dope but i'm very excited it's gonna be next saturday and i'm free next saturday like it just all worked out and i'm very excited so that'll be next next vlog so I'm at the sunset guys can't really see it not okay i hate that but it looks so pretty we had to park in this field because there's no parking so now we have to walk a mile but road rage it might happen. Not... Tell them oh yeah girl. oh my gosh i should have i should have recorded this in case there was an accident girl fast. because i would have been the freaking um Oh, I hate train tracks, bro. I get anxiety. You think trains gonna come out of nowhere? Literally, like you never know. <laughs> yeah, um, this is actually real dangerous, uh, right? So Baby, we about to run. We about to run across these tracks. But back to the story. <laughs> so we're at the like trying to get to this um price right, right? Price mm -hmm. right plaza. Mm -hmm. And no one at the light. Like it's like an intersection. So we're going this way. People are coming this way. No, like literally, the light changed like five times. Like not even being dramatic. No, it's yes. It changed five times. Everybody keeps inching, blocking up the place so no one could drive. This freaking Jeep got to add it. <laughs> this Jeep was about to hit someone because he was trying to like make a way. And people, mind you, parked, I thought he was about to jump out. Of yeah, like door. jump out and start fighting people <laughs> because it literally was so annoying because people had space to move up and back up to like make way. So at least yep. there would be one lane of traffic like. Y'all yep. are stupid. And then we all had to eventually block the way because why are y'all being dumb when driving? Like, literally. That sense is so beautiful. I wish you could it is. it. It's not as like, yeah, it don't look as vibrant, I feel no, like, on camera, on camera. But it looks very pretty in person. But yeah.
lit. Like I'm. <laughs> I said, why this beer got me lit? <laughs> like a little <laughs> buzz right now. It's this beer. It's so good. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, I'm okay. Yeah, that's the table with the guy with the shiny. I was over there. Wait. Or was it over there? This is the museum? No, we went over there. Well, that beer, Ooh, this okay, beer memory. right here. I think I took a picture. Yes. We're gonna buy it because so it's sold good. at Total. And it's like, what's it called? East, Dark Downy. Si Downy something cider, cider, donut. cider donut beer. Downer, yeah. I don't so like, good. we hate beer. I don't like beer. Make a little zoom in, zoom in. Look at that. Mm -hmm. took a, I think I took a video of it earlier. So good. When you were getting yours, because she wants uh, to copy me. Because at first she didn't want it, but I decided to take a risk. And she I found it. her, y'all. <laughs> I, I want to take a risk. I took a little sip and it was and I fire. Didn't. I don't like beer, so I want to try yours. I know, I don't like beer either, yeah. but it looked really good because other people had it. But yeah, we're, we're probably going to leave soon. <laughs> but I'm having fun. This beer definitely, I wish I would have had this at the beginning, but. Then we could uh, walk, walk through, around. and what that would have been was, was that would have been cool. great, but that was the okay. plan. That was the plan. Oh, did you tell them that we were standing in line for like ten minutes? And did then I? She, I don't know. If oh no. Okay, I don't think I did, but I did take a clip of the place. Oh. So like, I took a clip of the not copyright. Hold on. Give me fever, but I never see I'm gonna be the mini bitch that no king wants before. 